Bismillah. Bismillah, alhamdulillah, wa sallam, wa sallam. Who should we pray the janazah on? Um, so, let's say a Muslim died, but his body was lost. For example, he died in a battle and he couldn't find, uh, uh, or he died uh, no, not in a battle because a battle has, a, has uh, another uh, rule that we mention later. But he died, uh, drowned, for example, in the sea. He drowned in the sea, uh, and you know, the fish ate part of his body, but then you found, they found uh, an organ from this uh, person. So in this case, you can get this organ and you can do the janazah uh, on, on the person, that the, the deceased person, that you found an organ from this deceased person and you bury that organ uh, as if you uh, buried uh, him. Um, uh, however, if an organ was an amputated from a living Muslim, like we had a brother here who had, because of uh, uh, diabetes, he, uh, he, had a, he had a problem in his leg and he had to amputate his leg. So this, uh, this is sooner to bury the organ. So you, you actually take it to um, maybe to the, the graveyard and bury it or take it to a different place, but you don't pray Janazah on that because the person is still living, right? You are praying on the person, you don't pray on the organ. So even in the first case, you are praying on the person himself, not on the organ. But if you find uh, an organ that is amputated, it has to be, or it's sooner to bury. If a woman had a miscarriage and the baby made a sound and then died, whatever sound he made, or she made, uh, then died, we pray Janazah on the baby. Uh, if the baby otherwise shows any sign of life, so even if he didn't make a sound, but he made, shows any sign of life, and then dies, uh, we pray on him here as well. Otherwise, we don't pray on the baby that was miscarriaged. So if the baby doesn't show any sign of life, he was miscarriaged and he's dead from the point that he was miscarriaged, we don't pray Janazah on that baby. We bury him on him. Um, the martyr that uh, that died in a battle uh, with the disbelievers, uh, his body is not washed, and we don't pray janazah on him. And he, if he, if that means he dies during the battle, um, uh, because of the battle, because he was wounded during the battle and he died. So that's, that's, um, that matter, if he died, we, his body is not washed and we don't do janazah on him. That's, uh, that's a lot for today, inshallah.